breaking news. He raped and brutally beat a high school senior as she dropped off a book at the Bloomingdale Library. This morning, Kendrick Morris went back to court in hopes of getting a break on a 65-year prison sentence. We turn now to News Channel 8's Janet Jones to see what that judge decided after hearing emotional pleas from the victim's family. Judge Tharp called this a heinous, atrocious, and cruel crime, and that the only fitting punishment for Kendrick Morris is life in prison. In a packed courtroom, Judge Tharp read aloud for over 30 minutes. He considered everything he heard after a hearing last month where both the defense and prosecution gave countless testimonies. He weighed both crimes Morris committed. The first was when he was 15 years old when he raped a daycare worker. The second when he was 16 and brutally attacked and viciously raped Queen of Fu. Judge Tharp said Morris knew what he was doing and said the crime was more than youthful discretion. Queen's family was in court today, and while happy with the life sentence, their outcome will never change. It's not a, a, a joyous moment in any sense for us. Um, we're still going to have to go back home and take care of Queena forever. And nothing has changed for us in that aspect. In 20 years from now, the court will review Kendrick Morris's life sentence, but Queen's family tells me that her life sentence will never end. In Hillsborough County, Jana Jones, News Channel 8.